Hey, I'm Ben Bolin, and today's question is, why do your ears pop when you dive into the deep end of a pool? Well, if you've ever stuck your finger in your ear and don't act like you haven't, then you know about the ear canal. The ear canal is this tube that goes into your ear and at the end of it there's a thing we call the eardrum. We call it the eardrum because it's a skin stretched tightly over the end of your ear canal like the head of a drum. On the other side of the eardrum there's this hollow space filled with air. We call this the middle ear. It all goes back to pressure. Uh, ideally, we want the pressure in the middle ear to equal the outside pressure found in the ear canal. Luckily, our ears also have this thing called the eustachian tube. These eustachian tubes are capable of letting air out. They lead to your throat and the air can pass back and forth between these tubes to make sure that the pressure is equal. So what happens when you're diving into the deep area of the pool? The different pressure causes your eardrums to bow inward and this is picked up by all the nerves in your ears and there are a lot so it's painful you want to equalize this pressure one of the ways that you can do that easily is by holding your nose and blowing out you're increasing the air pressure in your throat and in your mouth and this is going through the tubes popping the ears and making you ideally feel much better, getting back to that point where the pressure is equal. So when you're rising back to the surface of the pool, the middle ear will generally automatically release some air through the eustachian tubes to get you back to normal air pressure. However, you can also hack this. You'll see people yawning or chewing gum to get that popping to occur. But this doesn't just happen in areas of increasing pressure like deep water. This could also happen in areas of decreasing pressure like when you're flying in a plane. Think of the layers of air surrounding the planet. The air up where a plane would fly is less dense than the air at the surface of the Earth. So once you get in this area of lower pressure, your eardrums start to bow outward because they're trying to equalize the pressure. Now once your ears pop, uh, you'll feel much better. You adjusted to this lower air pressure and then once you land and enter back to uh, the surface air pressure you have to readjust again so that's why your ears pop when you go into a deep pool or even when you go into the air it all goes back down to the idea of pressure thanks so much for watching uh, I have gone the entire time without doing a horrible rendition of Queens under pressure uh, I hope that we all enjoyed me not doing that. Uh, but you know what you will enjoy? You'll enjoy these uh, videos over here on the side. Uh, we'd love it if you would write in with some topics or suggestions for upcoming episodes. You can leave a comment, you can hit like, you can subscribe, and we'll see you next time.